Some students of Paul think that he was from a wealthy family. They base this upon a study of his letters. As they look at his letters, they see that he was well steeped in scripture. They also observe that here's a person who was familiar with uh, various uh, aspects of Greek and Roman rhetoric. When uh, those who say that Paul was from a wealthy family seek to make their case, they also uh, note that Roman citizenship was hard to come by. According to Acts, Paul was a Roman citizen. In fact, Acts claims that he was also a citizen of Tarsus. These kinds of things are not um, possessed by average people, it is argued. So they say that Paul's family uh, got citizenship perhaps through uh, purchase. Um, there are others, however, who say, no, Paul uh, was uh, not wealthy. Uh, most ancients were not. And Paul, like they, lived a subsistence existence, hand uh, to mouth. In fact, they point out that uh, Paul himself plied a trade. He was a leather worker, he was a tent maker. Maybe he learned this later uh, as he began to do his ministry, but more likely, they say, he learned it from his father. Uh, tent making is not exactly the work of an aristocrat. Truth be told, we don't know. We know precious little about Paul's upbringing. Spare the fact that he was raised by Jewish parents uh, and that he was raised in Tarsus uh, away from the motherland, uh, Jerusalem. Uh, it remains an issue of considerable interest though, um, but we certainly don't know that Paul was born with a silver spoon in his mouth.